Hey, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I wanted to show you all some styling ideas for the summertime and how I actually put those outfits together. So I have my clothing rack with my key pieces from my summer capsule wardrobe and I wanted to actually put these wardrobe essentials into action and style them into outfits for different occasions that I'll be doing during the summer. Each of the outfits are styled with a bag from the brand Burton Hyde. They are an affordable bag company that sells the cutest, affordable little bags. In fact, all the bags that I'm going to feature today are all under $40. I do think that the quality is quite comparable with the price point, and I'm really excited to show you how they just add a nice finishing touch to all my outfits. So let's dive right into the styling portion. So the first occasion or activity that I'll be doing for the summer is going like to some type of day at the lake like a beach we have we live by a lake so I can do like little beach days there it's not like an ocean beach but it's really nice to either do like a boat ride or just watch the sunset at night so the bag that I'm styling this outfit around is the Sabin bag from Burton Hyde this screams summer I really love the unique style of this I this reminds me of a straw bag but it's just such a like different take on it I really like the brown tones as well as the little gold hardware and the shape itself is just so cute so with this, if I was going to the beach and I was actually doing some type of swimming, then I would wear a swimsuit or some type of tank top. So I have two tank tops that are included in this capsule. And I love these tank tops because for one, they have enough fabric where there's no like side boob action going on. And also the actual neckline doesn't go up too high. I prefer something just normal like it doesn't have to be high I think that looks kind of weird with like a tank top so I really love the neckline of these I have it in black and white but because I'm going to be out in the sun probably at the lake beach I'm gonna go ahead and go with the white tank top because this top is fitted I definitely want to have something looser at the bottom and I have a few different choices I have like a flowy skirt that I could wear to the beach I also have like um, a flowy like pair of jeans. I probably won't wear any type of denim to the beach because that's just bad with water. So instead, I'm going to go with, you guessed it, my wide-legged trousers. I absolutely love these. And I think that you can, even if you still want to wear like shorts, you can go for like a more looser style shorts. But I love the combination of the two. And I really like how this rust color pairs so beautifully with the brown bag. I think that it's such a pretty little combination. And like I said, maybe if I was actually swimming, my top would be a swimsuit instead of just a normal tank top. And then I'm just gonna finish off the outfit with some brown accessories and then, so like my shoes and then also gold accessories to match the gold hardware on the bag. I'm going with very simple accessories. So I'll do like a dainty necklace and then like my little pineapple earrings. I don't wanna be too extra. I don't wanna lose anything in the sand, if that makes sense. So I'm just gonna go ahead and go with that outfit for my day at the lake. Outfit number two is for an outdoor dining situation. So this can be brunch or this can be later on in the evening. I want to dress up a little bit more, but I still want to keep it casual. The bag I'm styling this outfit around is the Esme bag. It has a very deconstructed, effortless style to it. And I got it in the color white. I also have it in black as well. This bag does come with a strap, so I could like wear it. Oh, it fell. <laughs> I could like wear it as a um, crossbody bag, but I actually preferred to wear it as a cute like little clutch. This particular bag is pretty trendy. I'm pretty sure you've seen it like on Instagram and Pinterest and all that. So when it comes to trying out trends, it's so good to stick to stores that are more affordable like Burton Hyde because you're able to play around with trends without breaking the bank. And that's how I feel with this bag. I am excited to wear it this summer. So with this bag, I kind of am getting some bohemian vibes. So I think that I'm going to go with some type of bohemian top. I have, first of all, this top here that's like a peplum style. I also have like a kind of flowy dress. But actually, I think I'm going to go with this dress again or this shirt again i've got the rust in the white combination which i really love this summer this rust color is a huge color in my color palette for the summer capsule wardrobe because this top does have a pretty like low v-neck i am going to be wearing a modesty panel i have this modesty panel on from etsy and i actually like how the white of the modesty panel is really going to tie in the bag as for my pants if i were to go outdoor dining like 
later on in the day, I'm pretty sure I would just be fine with just wearing jeans. So because I want to balance out the volume of this top with the bottom, I'm going to go ahead and go with either my mom jeans or my flare jeans. And I think that my flare jeans are going to add a nice like little bohemian touch or not touch just finish off with the whole bohemian vibe that I'm going for so I'll go ahead and pair my flare jeans with this top to help balance out the poofy sleeves and then I'm just gonna wear my brown shoes to finish off the outfit for the next outfit this is for some type of museum touring when I go to museums like an art museum I really like to dress smart but still comfortable because you're doing a lot of walking so to style this outfit I'm gonna start off with the Silve bag from Burton Hyde this is crazy because this was actually like the last choice of my bags for my selection for this video but this ended up being my favorite one I love this style it's very classic I was very impressed with the quality of this one out of well actually I like I really really like the quality of the Sabin one and I loved this one too I really like the braided like little strap detail here it also comes with another strap so if you want like a crossbody style you can do that but I kind of like this like shoulder bag style that this particular strap had if you watch my minimalist bag collection then you know that I have so many black bags so these three bags, including this neutral one, has really just been nice additions to my wardrobe and I think that they're actually more appropriate for the summertime. So with this bag, I'm going to go ahead and wear some type of skirt for the museum. I kind of want to dress feminine and smart, but still low-key. So I'm going to go ahead and go with a flowy skirt. I want to go with this one because I thought that the green color worked really nice with the tan color of the purse and then I'm gonna go ahead and just wear a white top so I have this white um, peplum top but I'm actually not gonna wear it as a peplum if you watched my modest lookbook from a few weeks ago I styled this top two different ways in that lookbook first as the regular peplum but then in the second outfit I actually wore it where I just folded up the peplum and it's just a cool way of showing you that you can wear clothing in so many different ways not just the way it's advertised and I also really like how the short kind of style works really nice with a high-waisted flowy skirt and then lastly I probably just wear some flats because I want to dress comfortable and be able to walk around take pictures for the museum trip and then I would keep my jewelry very simple because I kind of just want the um, purse and the skirt to be the focal point of the outfit when I saw the hardware on this bag it immediately made me think of my Margaret Coy necklace I actually have it on today the hardware of the Margaret Coy necklace matches perfectly with the hardware of this bag so I was like I'm definitely going to wear those two together in an outfit so along with these outfit ideas that I've styled with the Burton Hyde bags, I do have a discount code that you can use to buy your own little bag. I hope that with the affordable price point of the bags, as well as my discount, this can be like a nice little treat for you. Let me know which of the outfits was your favorite. And also, if you like this style video, I have fun just kind of like creating the outfits with you and planning them out so you kind of see my thought process. So let me know how you feel about this format of like a fashion lookbook. And I hope that I can see you all next week if you go ahead and subscribe. Mm -hmm.